Remember the pursuit of Portia where Portia acted at GD full thorn plates, knives, and boom kits, and boom mics, and everything else she could get. And Dennis and his mom, the next morning, everybody was like, where's Dennis? And, and they was like, Dennis and his mom left. They went back home, or, right? And then the producer said that Dennis went to a different part of Mexico. Baby, y'all ever wonder what Dennis was doing? What Dennis was up to? Y'all wondering about, about whether uh, Portia stole his sunshine, wiped that smile off his face, made it so that he couldn't even have a good time? I'm about to show y'all real footage of what Dennis was up to. But also, I want to ask y'all, let me know in the comments. After you see everything and you see my breakdown, does this put the pursuit of Portia in more context? Does this let you know why she was acting a fool? Why she seemed to be in a jealous rage? And why somebody that was in a thong and smoking hookah maybe got under her skin? I don't know. This might put the show in better context. And guess what? We found out. We tracked down who Miss Fong and Hooker was. And baby, woo, I see why Portia was so mad. Well, Dennis has actually released footage. Y'all want to see what he was up to? Y'all want to see? All right, let's roll this tape. Before we do, don't forget, I got my exclusive Members Only Live this Friday. It's going to be about 8.30 p.m. Make sure you sign up. We got juice. It's going to be good. And listen, my members will tell you I be predicting the future. People swear I be making up stuff, but apparently I can predict the future because everything I've said has come true. Anyway, I'm going to talk to y'all. Let's get back to the map. So let's set the scene in the crime, right? Portia just acted a fool, like I said. Dennis actually flee. Now, here's the thing. We know for a fact that Dennis had his work with them. It's unclear whether Miss Gina was still there or whether Miss Gina went home. But y'all, let's see. And guess what? It looked like Portia acting a fool made Dennis's holiday even sweeter because it looks like as soon as he got away from her, he was free to be himself. Let's look at this footage. All right, I'm going to let you guys watch this really quick. And then meet me because we're going to discuss and decipher. I was nosy, so we got a few clues. And you know I even tracked down the one that Dennis was with, but go ahead and enjoy. All right, so let's break, let's break this all the way down. So Dennis wanted to let us know. He jumped on Delta. He said, this ain't a damn thing. I'm out of here. Now, how do we know that Dennis actually stayed in Mexico? And this just isn't all like flashback because boom, we got the Riviera Maya. He let us know, baby, you might have ruined your own vacation with your granddaddy. But me and mine, we was chilling. We was cool. We literally hop, skipped and jumped and stayed at a better hotel, a better resort. How we know he stayed at a hotel? Because he was flexing. He was in the downtown hotel. If you guys have never been there, it's a super, super super cute hotel it's super fun and it's right in the middle of the action so it looks like dennis stayed there too by what he's showing us on um by what he's showing us D forget all that because guess what we got an id on the girl he was with y'all all right so let's be nosy and break this down one at a time first of all who's this lovely lady smoking hookah remember when lonnie said that dennis bought work and she was sitting by the pool in a thong smoking hookah yo i did some investigation and i think i found dennis's work but her name she miss work actually has a name it's erica janae and you know i had to be nosy and hop on over to her instagram so let's go look at her instagram y'all ready because we need to see if she looked like a bus. Because remember Portia said she can only, Jenna's uh, date can only come and she looked like a bus. Let's see if Miss Erica Jane looked like a bus. she damn sure don't look like a bus but oh she pretty she pretty she got face she got look at that smile okay dennis go get her let's see if we can find a lot a little bit more about her let's see all right she like she got to see oh she got body all right and she got face oh ooh, 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 ooh. Ooh, dennis looked like he had a good time in mexico i see why portia flipped out he bought somebody younger finer 
got that same playful attitude. Ooh, and if you look on her Instagram, she's actually a fitness trainer, right? Look at, ooh, look at that. So she got the body Porsche paid for. It's more of her Instagram. She got the body Porsche paid for, but she got it naturally being in the gym. No shade to anybody that goes under the surgeon is naive, but you know Porsche cares about. All right, let's see if we can see what Dennis did being nosy, breaking this down. All right, so I see, you know, you lounging by the pool, maxing, chillaxing, feeling all cool. But ooh, look at this. All right, you was also enjoying some brown liquor. It looks like a hot tub or a bathtub. All right, let me find out. He put some Nyack cognac in his suitcase. You know Dennis is always, always looking for a deal. Maybe he was down there to the local bars being like, yo, y'all got Nyack cognac? You don't? Here, try this, my man. It's smooth. No shame in that. You better hustle, baby. Right? That would be so funny to find out Dennis turned this into a business opportunity. All right, so let's see what else he was up to. Look at this food. Dennis is letting us know Mexico, though, throw back he was eating good baby you got steaks eggs and that kiota cheese Woo! and you got some what is that look like some papaya juice you know they have that papaya orange thing all right dennis you look like you was having a good time but where was your bae where was your work was she sitting there eating or was it all getting ready it's going down downtown all right it looks like listen it looks gorgeous warm weather lots of people around they look like they had lots to do there were street performers around. Look at that. They had the little club and the neon lights. Y'all ever know if you go to Mexico, how be getting down, right? You got that live. Listen, they got the best live musicians. This guy don't look like he want to be taped. But, you know, at the same time, hurry up and pay la cucaracha one more time. Hit that for me and my girl. But guess what? They didn't just also do things in the evening. They also went to like a petting zoo, bird sanctuary. Yo, this seems like a loved up couple's trip they wasn't just getting drunk and dancing like some other people trying to act like they so in love they actually did things that looked like they enjoyed each other's company right but they still got look there's fire eaters dennis wanted us to know you ain't stopped no good time we ate good we drank good we did everything good thank you so much and actually you took the stress off me by acting a damn fool ha ha and you know what dennis Listen, I don't know if he was trying to be petty, but I'm going to say he was. Look at this, showing a, some Don Julio, 1942. You know that's Porsche's granddaddy's favorite. Woo! That probably is something that, like, literally, again, maybe I'm starting mess, but to me, that seemed like it was some messy, messy shots fired. And look at this. That 1942 had the limes and the salt lined up. Yo, they had a good time. Sean. Yo, I see why Portia was so bad when they, she saw that girl in a thong smoking hooker. Dennis was supposed to be suffering, but y'all, I give it to Dennis, and I say this again. Go ahead and watch my recaps. I feel like Dennis handled it like a pro to be in that situation, man or woman. He handled it like a pro. And you know what? It's good to know that he ain't like somebody um, stopped the show, right? Because you could tell he ain't slowed down at all. And that girl he was with, woo! She ain't look like no bus, y'all. Let me know what you think in the comments about Dennis throwing up this reel. You think he was being shady? Probably not. Dennis is busy running businesses, right? That's what his granddaddy be doing, right? Up there playing Twitter fingers in the middle of the night on Instagram trying to convince the world that he ain't write his own fake bio. Anyway, you guys, let me know what you think. Does this put the context of the season of Portia's Family Matters in more context. Does this explain to you why Portia was so mad and what her beef was with Dennis? And do you think Dennis was like throwing a little shot or you think he was just minding his business, showing his reel, and I was the one being nosy that found his TikTok and was like, ooh, I see why she was mad. Let me know in the comments. I'll talk to y'all later.